Good morning. I hope everyone's having a great Saturday. You know, I get tons of emails at petersprinciples.com and one of the most common emails is people want a six pack. Core strength, abdominal muscles. Actually in three different magazines, that's the leading body part that people want to tone. I'm here with my daughter Dana at the Beverly Hills Club and she's doing a crunch and what you want to do is first dissect the abdominal muscles into three areas. First from belly button up, then belly button down, then the sides. We're gonna deal with belly button up. What you wanna do is basically fold your hands, have enough space here, like an apple or an orange worth, and have your body take your head up. As you come up, blow out on exertion. You don't have to come all the way up. And what you're doing is you're bending your knees, nice fluid range of motion, blow out on exertion, and you want to do, say, at least 10 repetitions. Now what you want to do is work from belly button down. Hands are on the side, and you're doing a reverse crunch. Now what Dana's going to do is knees are bent. You're coming in to your chest and blowing it out. So it's... Now, if you have back pain, put the brakes right here. So you're not going to come over your, your hip with your legs because each leg weighs a lot. So if you have back pain, you modify it and it's just And this is all working for belly button down, gravity takes toll, and if your back is strong, you show me a person with mushy abdominal muscles, I'll show you a person with back pain every time. So, no back pain, all bets are off, full range of motion. Last exercise is for the waist, the serratus, or what I call the love handles, the area we want to get rid of. What you do is you cross your leg and you take your opposite arm, just put it by your ear, out, and now she's going to take her body, this arm is here supported, take her body and come up, watch your head, just come around, and you do it. Good job. This is all working the waist, the side. Then you do the other side after 10 repetitions. Opposite arm, come up, blow it out. Watch the space here. Three great exercises, but there's some do's and don'ts when it comes to abdominal work. Always do your abdominal workout after your weight training. Always dissect your abs into three sections, upper, lower, and your waist. So you love handles. And train your abs every other day with 10 to 20 reps of three sets. The Peter's principle of the day is quite simple. You can work out until you're blue in the face and diddly is gonna happen if you're not disciplined at the breakfast, lunch, or dinner table. You're not gonna see your abs over fat. So make sure you do cardiovascular exercise, taking care of the most important muscle, your heart, and be diligent when you eat. You are what you eat. Until next week, I'm Peter Nielsen with Peter's Principles.